Hello, in this short series I'm going to show you how to add a uh, work breakdown structure in uh, B6. So the WBS is a, a hierarchical arrangement of the products and services produced during and by a project. Uh, WBS enables you to divide a project into logical pieces for the purpose of planning and uh, controlling it. And so for this, uh, we'll start by adding a child WBS element. WBS elements uh, added to the root level element are intended to inform the second level of the hierarchy uh, that the WBS code name from each WBS element contains the code name of its parent element. WBS uh, code names are alphanumerical. They can consist of number, text, or both. So for this, let's start first of all with uh, inside the P6 professional. And all the WBS elements will be added under the activities page. So we're going to insert. There are multiple uh, options. You can insert it either from the toolbar or by going to project and WBS. And in here, we're going to insert under new, we're going to actually add a WBS, which will, for example, be planning. And we're going to commit the changes. Now, let's see how this would look under web. So, for this, I'm already logged in to P6. And keep in mind this this is version um, this is uh, version 16. Okay, the project is already opened. So if we go under the activities panel, and this is the new HTML uh, uh, view. We'll also take a look at where it was looking in the old version. So. We have a new WBS as planning, so let's uh, switch the views. So I'm going to go to manage views and uh, select the WBS views, WBS only views. And I'm going to go with the defaults, just so you can see the other views. And once this refreshes, we'll have the option to add a child WBS. So in here, let's add a child, which will be first step. And this is under planning. We're going to save the changes. And let's also look how uh, this, let's take a look at how it looked under the old Java applets. So for this, I'm switching to the Java applets, and in the second, they should be loaded. And in here, you have the option to add the child WBS or right-click and insert the child WBS.